Hi, Jason Hollis Farms this morning. I'm about to run late. I got about 30 minutes. Out of the way, deer. Deer running across the road in front of me. I'm headed to the woods. See what we can see this morning. Maybe we can get one and get Dodge a little training today. I'm going to hurry on in here before it gets light. I'll be right back. Well, it was a pretty slow morning this morning, that one little buck, young buck, boy, he was pretty, pretty. Maybe he'll slip through this year. Anyway, we'll see what the rest of the day brings. I'll be back. All right, y'all, I'm running just a little late. I had to take care of a few things. Still got about two and a half hours before dark. I'm going to try to slip into a shooting house and see what we can see before dark. I'll be back. Most of them, as long as they ain't crazy ones. Oh, bang on just a second. They're just coming. I'll be right back.
has missed that deer. I ain't sure yet. I'm gonna get out here in just a second. I was fiddling with this dang camera. She got my wind a little bit. But what I was saying about these comments this time of year, a lot of these places I'm sitting, I don't have real good service, but that's what I was doing then when these deer started coming out was answering these comments. I like the comments. I'm going to hop down real quick and go see if I hit her. Dad, I believe I missed her. I have to get Cody up here shoot. I'll be right back. I didn't think I could have missed that deer, but anything's possible. I found some pretty good blood right where I shot her. I'm going to stay here just a little bit longer. Got a lot of comments today. I'm going to answer some of these before I get down and just kind of look see if anything else comes out that I want to film. I'm going to turn y'all around and show y'all the problem I was having just a second ago. That this shooting house, it really, we should have turned it around the other way. I'm kind of sitting in the, the long end of it. This field goes that way and this way. I'm going to turn you around and show you these windows. I really, I like these windows, except for the camera. I was having to move the camera. Let me turn it around. I'm going to show y'all. These windows are, are, I call them like a drive through window, like an old restaurant window. They slide back and forth like that and if I could have had the window up I could have filmed the deer right through there but I didn't want to be blurry I was having to pick it up and move it because she was getting my wind and move it from hole to hole but anyway it just always you never know what's going to happen even fooling with these does when rifle season starts boy it's on, man. It's a whole new ball game. These old Alabama does will bust you in just a minute. Whew. And I got this tripod in here. It's big and takes up a lot of room. I usually got my GoPro going and I didn't even think about cutting it on. But I'm going to sit here a little bit longer, answer some of these comments, get that out of the way for a little while. And it's still about two hours for dark sit up here to let things settle down again and then I want to make sure I got plenty of time to go get Dodge and work him. It was some pretty good blood down there so anyway I'll be back in just a minute. I was just thinking and that can be dangerous sometimes but another thing on them comments me and Brian read them all. We read all the comments and Sometimes you get a crazy one every now and again, but 99% of them is great and it makes you feel good about what we're doing. But I, I'm not a big texter and all that stuff. People kind of get on to me because I yep and no, but I don't get in depth on texting and stuff. I'll talk on the phone, but we read all these texts and a lot of times I just give a thumbs up or thanks or whatever, but that's just the way I am, and I'm busy as heck, so I'm not going to get in real depth on these comments, but what it does, it gives me ideas for other videos, and also a lot of the new subscribers and people we got watching, a lot of these questions... And I've noticed when y'all commented back, y'all went back and watched. A lot of this stuff has been answered in past videos. And if it's a comment that has been answered in a past video, I try to remember and put it up there. Like I said, making these videos and putting one out every day and sometimes two a day, plus working seven days a week, kind of runs you ragged. I mean, it's, um, it is like a second full-time job, and we enjoy it. I really do. It's It puts a whole new perspective on hunting. 
and trying to film it and all. It's fun. Really fun. Sometimes you forget stuff. Like that deal a while ago, I went back and looked at it. Can't really see the shot. They probably wouldn't have put it on TV on the outdoor channel, but I'm going to put it on YouTube. So, But I'm going to see it just a little bit longer. I'm ready to go get Dodge and put the collar on him and work him. So I'll be back. Alright, I'm going to do the same thing again. I got Dodge on the lead. And as y'all see, I got him a, I turn y'all around, I got him a harness now. Because he pulls so hard and I don't want to choke him. Because I'm going to, I want to break him to the lead. And I want him to z really zone in on what we're doing. So, let's see what he'll do. Alright, the deer, I shot her. Found the other side of this tree here. I'm gonna lead him up to this first blood I found. I'll see him. He's already winding it. First blood right there. All right, I'm gonna turn him loose and let him go to work and see what he'll do. All right, I just turned him loose. See that blood there? I'm just gonna let him work. We'll kind of stay back here. This one's kind of stumping both of us. She was bleeding really good. We've run out. I'm just going to kind of start making a few circles and letting Dodge work and see if he can pick it back up. He acts like he's winding something right there. Let's see what happens. Going on in there. I can't see him no more. I'm going to let him go for a minute and uh, look at the collar and see what he's doing. All right, the collar's showing him set down. I'm going to ease towards him, and maybe he's found it. I don't know. He left like he was smelling something. And blood's done stopped. All right, I'm getting pretty close to him. It's pretty thick in here. I'll be able to see him here in just a second. Look at there. Oh, Dodge. Good boy, Dodge. Good boy, got that deer. Good boy. I'm coming, I'm coming. There's a little bit of blood right there right before she fell, but I ain't seen nothing on the way in here. I guess he just winded her. Smelling something I can't. Good boy, Dodge. Good boy, Dodge. All right, y'all, I believe I'm finna call it a day. If y'all like our stuff, subscribe to us. Hollis Farms. Appreciate y'all watching. Out of here.